If you've been struggling to find products to drop ship onto eBay successfully, or you're brand new and you don't know where to start when it comes to product research, then you wanna check out this software that I'm going to show you today. Because this software, I've been using it for about five years, and when I found it, it really changed the game for me because it showed me all these products that were already successfully selling on eBay, so I could then turn around and sell the same products or very similar ones. It just gives you a ton of data on what's hot and popular right now on eBay so that you can make sure that all the items you add into your store are products that people actually want to purchase. So I'll be giving an in-depth review and showing you how this software works today. And the reason I'm making this video now is because this software has just been updated to make it even better. So I'll show you what's new about it and what makes it better. So this is the software right here, it's called Zeek. Now, prior to this, the software was called Zeek Analytics, but they've rebranded it to Zeek, kind of streamlined not only their name, but also the software as well. So if you've used Zeek Analytics in the past, now Zeek, you're gonna see that this largely looks the same, but it's just a little bit more sleek. And this is kind of part of their new journey because what they're trying to do is really be an all-inclusive e-commerce platform that helps you not only sell on eBay, but other platforms as well, such as Amazon and Shopify. They really wanna help as many people as possible achieve independence through e-commerce, no matter what channel you end up selling on. So like I said, this largely looks the same for right now as to how it used to look, with just some minor sort of updates to the UI to make it look a lot sleeker. But if you've used Zeek Analytics in the past, what you'll notice with Zeek is that it's a lot, lot faster. Every time you click things, everything just works a lot faster. You'll also see that everything that you click, it pulls up all the information just instantly. So right away after using this for a few days, that's the biggest difference that I've noticed, which is really helpful because as we're doing product research, we wanna do it as quickly as possible to find as many items as we can. So let me show you how a lot of these tools work on Zeek Analytics, help you find these winning products for, for eBay. Later on, they're going to be adding research tools for Amazon and for Shopify, but for right now, we just have the eBay tools. So right here on the dashboard, we're gonna first look at the trending eBay products section. And what I should say actually is that there are a lot of different tools that it has to help you find products. I'm not even gonna go over all of them today because there are quite frankly so many of them, but I'll show you some of my favorites. So I like looking right here on the dashboard when I log in at the trending eBay products section. You can actually modify this. So you can say, hey, I'm selling on eBay or I'm selling on Shopify or eventually they're gonna have selling on Amazon. But we're gonna stick to eBay right now and eBay.com. My model is drop shipping. And where do you want to source from? Well, let's say you want to source from AliExpress and you want items that ship from China. So now this will show you products that people have already been successfully drop shipping from AliExpress onto eBay. And you'll not only see how many times the item has sold in total, you'll also see how many times the item has sold in the past month and what the price of that item is. So right here we have like these, I don't even know what these are, stamps? Some, some sort of colors for stamps. Uh, these have sold 59 times in total for five bucks. Not a great product because it's so cheap, but we can come over to this one. This one's $36 and it sold 12 times. In fact, it sold 12 times in the past month. This is a great product because largely what we're looking for are not only items that have sold, but items that have sold recently within the past 30 days. Actually, yeah, the past 30 days. And that's what this product is right here. So now if I wanted to buy this product or actually add it to my store, I should say, all I have to do is click on this and it's showing me similar products that are available on AliExpress. Now, a lot of times you'll see the exact same product here, but I would actually encourage you to try to find ones that are not an exact match, but ones that are very similar. That way you don't have to have as much competition for that item than if you were selling the exact same one. So for instance, this one right here looks very, very similar. It's only $13 and you could sell it for, we know, $35, $36 and people are buying it. So that right there is a winning product that you can source from AliExpress. What else we have here? We have this, uh, I'm not even sure what this thing is right here, but this item is sold 12 times in the past month 
and it is sold 549 times in total. That tells me that not only has this item continued to sell right now, but it is sold in the past as well. This is a fantastic item to add into your store because you're gonna see with items like this that they have a great sales history and they are continuing to sell as well. Some items like this, this Christmas tree star, this item is popular right now, but come January, it's gonna stop selling. But this one we know is going to sell all year long because we see that sales history right here. And for $39, I'm sure you can find something very similar on AliExpress. So that's the trending eBay product section. Like I say, you can also say, hey, I wanna source from like Amazon and see products to drop ship from Amazon to eBay. You see a lot of those right here. Like whatever this one is, this actually tells you the profit. So for this one, it's $16 profit and it is sold five times in the past month. So right here, you can get a lot of great products that are trending. So definitely check out this section right here. Now coming over here on the left, one thing that's useful is looking at the trending eBay niches section. So this will actually show you uh, niches or niches, however you wanna say it, that have been popular in the past 30 days on eBay. So we see things like LED string lights are popular, string lights, solar. A lot of these lights tend to be really popular, wallets, motion sensor lights, silver chain necklace. And what you can do is you can click on any of these and it will actually scan those keywords for you on eBay, pulling that data from eBay and giving you information on what products are popular. So again, I search here basically for silver chain necklace and it's telling me, hey, of the 100 listings analyzed, we have over $22,000 in sales. And down here, you can see exactly which products are selling. So we have like this, th these necklaces that have sold uh, 4,000 times in total, about 300 times in the past month. We have this one that has sold 30,000 times in total, 185 times in the past month. So it kind of gives you that data on which ones are actually selling. I don't particularly sell jewelry, jewelry myself, but that's just a good example if you kind of want to look at the different niches. But what I find actually a lot more useful is this section right here, which is a trending drop shippers section. What this is, is Zeke Analytics is, sorry, Zeke, I should say, is actually really good at analyzing different seller stores and determining if they're a drop shipper or not. So based on that, it pulls in all those drop shippers into this section and will show you ones that are doing well selling on eBay ones that are doing tens of thousands of dollars a month with this system. So for instance, if we look over here, this seller right here has done about $18,000 in the past month. This one has done $24,000 in the past month. This one has done $28,000 in the past month, all with this drop shipping system onto eBay. And what's really cool is that you can actually scan any of these sellers stores. So this seller, for instance, has done 40 grand in the past month. Let's go ahead and click on this icon and this is actually going to scan their store. That was very fast. This software was fast in the past, but it has gotten a whole lot faster. That was like one second and it was able to look at every single item in this seller store. And this seller has, it says 17,000 products. It looked at all of them and has ranked them from the most popular item to the least popular item in just one second. Normally, this would take you hours and hours, days and days to do this on eBay manually, and you can literally do it with one click here on Zeke. So coming down here, we can actually see all the products. So this one has sold eight times in the past 30 days, 82 times in total for like $20. And it says you can source it from Amazon, so you can click on that and actually find it on Amazon. And just tons and tons of these products. I'm usually looking for items that have sold at least three times in the past month. There's plenty of them on here. So I can go ahead and source these same products, or again, usually I look for very similar ones, so I'm not in direct competition with these sellers. Really, really powerful tool, this trending dropshipper section, because as a new seller, you don't really know what items to sell, and you can take a look at other dropshipper stores and see what they're doing well. This is what I teach my students how to do, and it works. So here's one of my students. They just started a couple of months ago and they're already at $13,000 in sales. 
So, you know, this absolutely does work with this method. And this seller, I guarantee you, primarily probably did look at other drop shippers to begin with because it's the quickest way to kind of get a great idea of what types of products you should be selling as a drop shipper. Now, so far, we have only looked at the dashboard. There are a lot of other tools over here that I want to show you. But before we get to that, if you think you want to try out this software for yourself, Zeke, I have a link to it in the description down below. And if you use that link, you can actually get a free trial of it. So definitely go ahead and use that link. That, that is my affiliate link, but it doesn't cost you anything extra to use it. And you get a free trial with that link. So definitely try it out and just give it a shot. I think you're going to love it. All right. So coming over here on the left, let's take a look at the product research tool. So this is similar to what we used before when we were on the dashboard and clicked on LED or whatever it was, uh, string lights, or actually we clicked on uh, silver chain necklace. This allows you to do the same thing, but with any keywords that you want. So right now we are in the thick of the Christmas shopping season. So if I typed in here, Christmas trees, and let's say I wanted to sell on eBay. I want items that ship from the United States. I want to see the sales from the past 30 days. And let's say for a minimum price, I want items that are at least, let's say 30, let's say $45. That way we get free shipping from our supplier. And we only want fixed price listings, not auction and items that are brand new. And we'll click on search. So now it's looking through eBay for all the items that match that criteria. And again, we'll rank them. So right now you see this is very popular. It's doing over $100,000 in sales of the just 100 listings that I analyzed. And coming down here, you can see which results are the most popular. So this pre-lit fiber optic Christmas tree has sold 222 times in the past month for almost $60. So that is a fantastic winning product. Now, what I like to do is I like to not look at single listings here. I like to look at trends that are showing up. So the most popular one here is this pre-lit fiber optic Christmas tree. The next one is an artificial Christmas tree with LED lights already on it. The next one is the same thing. The next one is the same thing. The next one is the same thing. So obviously what are popular are these pre-lit Christmas trees. And I also like to look at the price as well. $58, $46, $74, $69. So I'm looking at items that are in about like the $60 range. That is going to sell quite well if I can get these artificial Christmas trees that are pre-lit. Now, the other cool thing is that this will actually show you people who are drop shipping right here. So this logo means they're a drop shipper, they're a drop shipper, they're a drop shipper. This is a person's a drop shipper. So plenty of drop shippers that are doing this. So what I can now do is I can go on to Amazon, Walmart, Home Depot and see, hey, can I find a pre-lit fiber optic artificial Christmas tree that I could sell on eBay for around $60 or maybe even a little bit more. Some of these are selling for like $69. So if I could find one that I could sell for $60, then I can go ahead and sell that same one. Uh, I mean, sell that one that I found and I'll be able to make some sales because it is similar to these ones and it's a similar price as well. So that's how I like to use the product research tool right here. Um, coming along, we can find the competitor research tool. And this is very similar to the tool that we use on dashboard. So when we came over here to the trending dropshipper section and we scan the seller store, that is a competitor research tool. So you could actually put up in here any seller's name that you want, just copy down the name of their store and paste it in here and it will give you their results. It will tell you how much they're selling every single month. And again, ranking from their most popular product to their least popular product. One of my favorite tools inside of Zeek, because again, if you know the person is a drop shipper, you'll instantly know which of their products are actually selling well. The other tool that I use quite often, or me and my team use quite often, is the title builder tool inside of here. And this will actually give you data on which keywords people are searching for when they're looking for Christmas trees on eBay. This is really important because you want to fill your title on eBay with these keywords. So for instance, down here we see on the left, we see these long tail keywords, and on the right we have the generic single word keywords. 
So I provided Christmas trees, but it's telling me, hey, when people are searching for Christmas trees, they're usually searching for artificial Christmas tree. So you better believe that when I list this item, I'm going to create the title and put in it artificial Christmas tree. And I'm also gonna include the word optic, colorful. If it applies, Xmas, that is very popular as well. And maybe even mini, if that one applies. And we can see those keywords over here as well. Artificial, lights, pre-lit, holiday, optic, pine. I know these keywords are doing well, so I'm gonna fill this uh, title with these exact keywords. Now there's actually another place you can find keywords as well for titles. So if we come back over here to the product research tool, the results that we found for Christmas trees, if you actually click up here where it says title analytics, what Zeke does is it looks at all of the titles for these products that are selling down here and it analyzes those titles. So it's saying, hey, this is the best selling title right here. Then this one, then this one, then this one. And if you come down here, it gives you more of this information as well. Very similar to what we see in the actual title builder, but this is actually based on the results of the keyword that we search for uh, and the results of all these products analyzed that we know are selling well. So this is another place that you can use to get a lot of these keywords as well. So two places, really, really powerful. In fact, you could even start with one of these titles right here, but I would suggest changing it up and making sure that it actually applies for your exact listing. Now, that is honestly just the tip of the iceberg. There are advanced tools in here as well, such as the bulk seller, the 500 best selling eBay products, which kind of just gives you a list of the best selling eBay products. We also have the turbo scanner, which is really, really powerful. This, I'll show you some results that I did not too long ago. So this is showing me products based on very specific criteria. So you can really whittle it down to exactly what you're looking for, which supplier, what price range based on reviews. You can really, really dial it in to exactly what you want and get those results. So for instance, this gives me all these results that fit my criteria exactly, which means I have to spend less time sorting through them and can just quickly add these items into my store based on what my supplier is. You can also save different competitors that you've scanned their store and see that they're selling really well and you wanna come back to them later. So you can do that as well. And there's some other settings in here as well, as well as some learning uh, information if you wanna learn more about dropshipping. So once again, if you wanna try Zeke out for yourself, you might as well give it a shot because I have that free trial if you use the link in the description down below. Just try it out for yourself. I think you're gonna love it because I've been using it again for five or six years at this point, And it's the only one that I use. It's the one we use every time we're looking for products to sell. And it's what I teach my students how to use as well. I showed you one of my students' results who had just started a couple of months ago. It's a very, very great tool and it's only gotten a lot better and a lot faster. And I'm really excited to see what features they add coming up, especially for selling on other marketplaces like Amazon and like Shopify. So if you like this video, make sure to give it a thumbs up and subscribe to the channel. If you wanna see another video where I use Zeke to find products to dropship onto eBay, then check out this video right here and I'll see you there in just one second.